All this month, get up to $50 off any Android smartphone from Appalachian Wireless. Any Android you desire. All $50 off with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. There are many opposing opinions over the reasonable bond issue. There is one thing all parties can agree on. The cost of housing a county inmate is a burden carried by the taxpayer. We've estimated uh, last year that it's about $29 a day per inmate. That's for a county inmate. Uh, we generally keep our average populations about 150 and we keep usually about 50 state inmates so therefore we've got 100 county inmates. $29 a day doesn't sound like much, but it does add up, especially when you take the inmate medical cost into consideration. These people that come in here are not in the best of health in the world. You know, a lot of these people have been on drugs, they've not been taking their blood pressure medicine, they've not been taking their blood thinners, they've not been taking their seizure medicine. You know, and when they come in here and get detoxed off, and, and you know, that's when the problems start and that's when we have to start. A lot of people don't realize once once you're incarcerated, your health insurance is null and void. I mean, you you know you have zero health insurance. So any you can just imagine one trip to the emergency room or one you know one trip to to the hospital period is you know how expensive that runs. Of course, you know the taxpayers and the county is is who's responsible to pick that tab up. Halbert went on to say that the county judges and attorneys always help him reduce his inmate population when needed by reducing bonds. Reporting from Prestonsburg, I'm Sean Allen for EKB News.